engineering and technology students from East Los Angeles College taking Professor Davidian's GE212 Introduction to Engineering Design in the spring of 2018. My name is Eric Chavarria. I am team captain for Team Death Star, and my team consists of Raymond Hidalgo, Anthony Rodriguez, Andrew Flores, and I am Gerardo Hernandez Vallejo, team leader of Team Archimedes, and my team consists of Philip Hall, Wei Kong Wu, Angel Sanchez, and Stephanie Hong. Our project is an RC Sterling engine powered car, uh, project named Chimera. So, right now I'll be talking about the uh, relays that are on the bottom of the vehicle. This allows the car to travel both forward and in reverse. Here are the actual relays, and they do so by changing the direction of the current. I will be talking about our steering mechanism, which was taken from a previous RC. It allows our vehicle to run left and right, and is being powered by a battery cell integrated with the PCB board uh, in the back. Now we're going to talk about our driving mechanic. We are using a high-powered uh, high gearbox, high efficiency. This is our drive motor being powered by our generator. We have here interchangeable gears for different gear ratios. We are currently using a 64.8 to 1 gear ratio. On the top inside this box, there is a PCB board which we have taken from a RC car. And we redesigned this PCB board in order to do the turn of mechanism and also provide signals to the relay in order to achieve forward and backward. And right here, it is a remote control which will pair with this RC uh, PCB board. Now we're going to talk about our 3D printed components. We have our chassis here that consists of two parts. We have our stabilizer bracket and our 3D wheel parts which we coated to provide more friction. Next, I'll be talking about our starting engine, which is here. The starting engine works with the compression and decompression of hot and cold air. Uh, our starting engine is the, the battery to power our drive. I'll be talking about the Sterling engine's power transformation process. Um, so we start off with thermal energy, which uh, heats the hot air chamber uh, and expands the air, which displaces the piston, causing the flywheel to rotate, um, which is mechanical energy. And the flywheel then moves the pulley and turns the generator, um, which is electrical output, and will power our drive. And now we're going to demonstrate our Sterling engine RC car. Now we move forward. We turn. Turn to the opposite direction. Now we we'll proceed in reverse. And that concludes our presentation. Thank you for your time.